Hi, we're going to practice putting numbers in order up to 30. So our first question wants us to put numbers in order from least to greatest. I have 6, 21, 25, and 9. So when I think of putting numbers in order from least to greatest, I think of age. I'm going youngest to oldest. So which one of these numbers would be the youngest? 6, 21, 25, or 9? 6 is the youngest. Who would be the next youngest? Someone that's 21, 25, or 9? A nine-year-old would come next. And then 21 and 25, they're already set up for us. Good job, let's try another. Put these numbers in order also from least to greatest. Okay, we have 24, seven, 26, and nine. So which one of those, think of age, is going to be the youngest. A seven-year-old would be the youngest. Which one would come next? A nine-year-old would. And then look, it has 24 and 26. If we're just looking at these two numbers, if I were to count in order, I would go 24, 25, which we skip, and then 26. So we're in the correct order. Again, we're putting in order from least to greatest, 8, 11, 5, and 24. Which one would go first? Which is the least, the lowest? 5 is. Then 8. And I know these two are my lowest because they're single digits. These two numbers have two digits. So we have 11 and 24. So let's think of age. Will you turn 11 first or will you turn 24 first? You're going to turn 11 first. So we're good to go. 5, 8, 11, 24. Again, we want to put these numbers in order from least to greatest. 27, 8, 24, 17. Which one of these will go first as the least? Think of age. Which one of these would be the youngest? An eight-year-old. Then we have 27, 24, and 17. Which one would come after that? A 17-year-old would because the teens come before the 20s. So then all we have left is 27, and 24. So which would come first between these two? Think of age. What will I turn first? Will I be 27 first or 24 first? I'll be 24. I can't be 24 after 27. So 8, 17, 24, 27. Good job. Next one. Still going in order from least to greatest, 26, 4, 24, and 30. Which one is the lowest, the least, the youngest? Either one of those words can help you remember. 4 is the youngest. Then we have 26, 24, and 30. Well, I already know. That 30 is the highest because my 20s are going to come before the 30s. So I have to see if these two middle numbers need to be switched or not. So let's do our age trick again. Which age am I going to turn first? Will I be 26 and then turn 24? Or will I be 24 and then get to 26? Right, it goes 24, 25, 26. Next question, still going, least to greatest, and I like to circle that so it sticks out to me. 25, 9, 28, and 23. Least to greatest, which one is the least? 
nine is the least. And I know that right away because that's a single digit. The other three are in the 20s. Which one would come next? 25, 28, or 23? 23 would come next. Then 25 and 28. Good job. Let's go for another one. This time we have 18, 13, 2, and 30. And we're still going from least to greatest. Which one will go first? Which is our least? Again, think of age if it helps you. 2 is the lowest, the least. And look, 30 is already over here. That's the highest. I know 30 is higher than 13, and I know 30 is higher than 18. So I just need to see if these two middle ones need to be switched. So I'm going to think of birthdays again. Which age will I turn first? Will I turn 13 first or 18 first? 13. So 2, 13, 18, 30 are the numbers from least to greatest. Let's do another one. 30, 22, 23, 29. We want them from least to greatest. Now there's no single digits this time. They're all double digits, two digits. Okay, so I see that I have a 30. Is that going to be the lowest or the highest, the least or the greatest? It's going to be the greatest. Now let's look. Let's see what we have. We have 22, 23. That looks good. Does 23 come before 29? It does. Not right before, but it is before it. Does 29 come before 30? Yes. Great job. Next one. Least to greatest again. Okay, which one goes first? It's already there, the one. Then we have 20, 28, and 19. I see two in the 20s and one in the teens. So the teens go before the 20s. And then is it 20, then 28? Or is it 28 and then 20? Which one is lower? 20 is. So 1, 19, 20, and 28 is from least to greatest. Let's do one more. We have 13, 19, 5, and 3. What's my least? 3. What's my second least? 5. And then what comes next? 13 does, which means 19 is my greatest. 3, 5, 13, 19. That's least to greatest. And you just finished another good activity. We'll see you next time.